All right, how is everybody today? This is Bruce, and my little guy Trace is usually with me, but he's not uh, here today helping me out. And my other assistant, Chris, is uh, taking a little break, but I figured I'd do a quick video and show what we have found over the last few days. If you guys have been watching our previous videos, you know that we've been doing some major picking out in the country, and whoop, oh, there he is, there's Chris. Look at that guy. Whoa, don't look at that mess over there. Uh, anyway, we've been, um, he's tired today. Uh, we've been doing some country picking and we were at a house the other day and kind of a hoarder's house um, and found some goodies. So I'm just gonna show you some stuff that we have uncovered. By the way, if you like what we do, please subscribe, smash that like button and hit the bell for notifications and let us know that you enjoy this channel by commenting below share with your friends family loved ones buddies help us get this channel going more we need more subscribers and with you guys we can do it all right so without further ado we're gonna just kind of move forward here quickly We've got, that's an old countertop uh, meat grinder. I'm pretty sure you hook it to the countertop and it's got all kinds of different parts there. Uh, we got some Pyrex. We got some, or that could be corning wire. I forget what it is. And then we got some Falls Graph. Uh, we found some baseball stuff. Don't know the value of these. Uh, they're from the 90s, probably probably nothing but you never know yeah never know uh over here we have an old two level coffee pot kind of a unique little item i don't remember who makes that um found humpty dumpty we found him look at this neat little old clock we found also that's pretty cool looking uh, let's see here. We found got found all kinds of plates. Nothing major, just plates, but some nice plates. Somebody paid a lot of money for this stuff. Christmas wear. Uh, what do we got here? We got more dishes. We got a Harley Davidson helmet. We got some uh, shirts. Uh, I don't remember the significance of those, but. It's a baseball shirt. Is that what they are? Or basketball. It looks like this is basketball. Basketball. Yeah. And I don't know what that other one is. I should take these inside so they don't get dirty. Um, we found some Star Trek glasses. What year were those from again? 2012? We found, I think that's Empire Strikes Back. Some old Campbell's cups. Um, we found, this is some old Pyrex. I don't know if that's all scratched up or if it's just dirty. I've never seen those kind of Pyrex bowls. Not sure what these are, but I figured since they were in here with all these like collectible items that they could be collectible. 2012. 2012? Yep. Uh, let's see here. We just dug out this brand new airsoft gun. Yep. Still in the box. Just dug that out from the back there. We've got a Longenberger basket. Don't know the value of that. All kinds of videos, Disney videos. Uh, unopened box, Beverly Hillbillies. And somewhere in here, nope, I'm wondering if it's worth some money and kind of thinking it might be. There's the... Uh, there's the first Pokemon movie. There's the Olsen twins. Oh, right here. When they were young, never opened. I'm curious to see what that's worth. Uh, what do we got here? We have a water purification kit. Brand new, never opened. Lord of the Rings. We've got, those are the video games. This is the character. Um, here we've got a, a three level sub search. Uh, what else? Silver. I think a lot of that's silver. Like, real silver down there. Um, oh, check these out. Old baseball caps. A lot of these are very old. I 
thought I looked that one up and I thought that one was worth like 150 bucks. I think I got two boxes for like $20 maybe, plus some other stuff, I think. Um, what do we got? We got, we found some, some, uh, cookie molds, Longenberger pottery cookie molds. Don't know what those are worth. Um, we got more dishes back there. Let's see here. We got some army stuff. Yep, that's what that is. And there's all kinds of patches down in there. I don't know if you can see that. I can't reach. Uh, what do we got? More dishware. We got, this is a box of like old Star Wars stuff. Probably not worth anything, but just a box of Star Wars stuff. Um, okay, and then, uh, what did we have over here? And we found all kinds of, uh, signed artwork in that thing, um, like creative, uh, stuff, like fish, like, made out of wood, fish, and things like that. Um, in here, we've got all kinds of games. I don't know what these, if these are gonna be worth anything, but I'm kind of thinking they might be. Mm. What year is this? Ah, see, this isn't in here. 3D. That's not in there. I don't feel like nothing either. Some of them might be. This one's got stuff in it. That one's empty? Yeah. Uh, and here's something you guys might not know about at all. These things here, these are patterns, and you see the, the the pictures there. That's what this is. This somebody would like. There's there's like paper inside of here, and there's all the paper. Basically, you cut those out, you put it together like a puzzle, and you make this outfit. <clears throat> People collect these. I don't know what uh, year this one is sometimes you can find the year but I have one two three four five crates of those I'm thinking they're gonna sell for three to five hundred dollars I'll just put them all on as a lot yeah that's right I said three to five hundred dollars um, we found those books right there lost civilizations those are worth money um, yeah, so just wanted to show you guys. Oh, old butcher block table. Well, probably not really old, but it's a butcher block table. And I tell you, if you guys ever come across even like a smaller version of those, those could be a hundred, two hundred bucks. But I mean, I'm thinking, I'm thinking that one's probably easily worth a couple hundred dollars. And I don't know if it's just because of the wood, you know, how thick that is, or what really makes them valuable but if you ever come across them it's a good thing to pick up so uh that that's about it um we found i also found this bed this is from like 1994 i think um probably had a price tag on it for a thousand dollars that sucker is heavy and we found some old railing came off of the house one two three like four or five pieces of old uh, hand railing yeah this was neat too um that's a, a bayonet I feel like a it was in a box and there's no marking on it but it does have a serial number right there it's just a serial number but um i don't think it's old it looks looks new but that goes on the end. That's what they used to put on the end of um, uh, rifles or muzzle loaders back in the day. And you'd stab somebody with it. So, yep, that's it, guys. Thanks for checking us out. My name is Bruce right here. And that is Chris doing, striking the pose, doing the Vogue. And thanks for uh, checking us out. Please don't forget, like, subscribe, smash that like button, share the video, hit the notification bell.
Thank you very much. Have a great day. We appreciate you looking at us. Check out our other videos. Bye. Thumbs up.